Anything else on the show? Just the, the, the burial of Sasha again. I couldn't, I couldn't believe that that's how they booked that. I mean, they booked that finish to, to just absolutely just bury it. Bro, tell me if you guys agree with me. To me, it was booked backwards. It was like yeah. Charlotte was the face. Yeah. This is not helping think, Sasha. Think about, what, you know the, what? the funny bro, bro, let me just say this, this. The funniest thing about this is I don't know whether these people like the WWE or whether they like Sasha, but I've got people arguing with me on Twitter that they're selling – like I've seen MMA fights that where they, they, the guy taps out with two seconds left in the round and something. I'm like, I go, I'm like, exactly. And what do you feel about the guy if you are a fan of his? You know, like you feel right. good about the guy that he couldn't wait two more seconds before he tapped out. Bro, I go, it's a big pop when you beat the clock. Right. I, like when we do that, that creates a big pop. I said this thing was booked so backwards. She should have been tapped. She should have been ready to tap and beat the clock and got a pop. She's still hurt from going to submission. They go into overtime. She's hurt in submission. She fights back. She gets beat up again and gets put on again, and finally she taps. And but beating the clock would have created a pop. Bro, tapping out to go to – that was this is the equivalent, Conan. You can appreciate this. This would be the equivalent if you were the New York Yankees and you were in game seven up at home and you had a no-hitter and you're up one nothing at the bottom of the ninth. You got Manny Ramirez – O two 2 pitch and he hit a home run. Right. <laughs> like, like, how would you feel if you were, if you were the fans? You know, right. you feel like you'd feel miserable. You feel right. terrible. And then if they would have lost in the extra innings, you'd go home and you'd feel awful. There'd be no right. redeeming quality about the team that you'd think like, oh my God, I can't believe my team did this to me. Here's you know, the worst part about of everything you just said. Yeah. They have the ability to control that yes. and they don't. No, but for some reason, they just love to bury this chick. I don't Bro, know why. And, and, and here's the thing. Are we all in agreement that this girl is a marketing bonanza that so many girls connect with? Well, it just 100%. brings us back to what, what question does it always bring us back to? She's got heat. <laughs> it, it's got I, you know, I heard she married like, the seamstress. <laughs> I, I can see yeah. this. I can see this already. I tried to get her drunk, gave her some Molly. She wouldn't go for it. Let's bury her. <laughs> you know? bury, bury her. God, I couldn't believe that, man. And uh, why, bro? It's ridiculous, man. It, it, it is. It is. But, but the funny thing is, like, I, I can't. I can't believe everybody doesn't look at that from that perspective. I got people that sit there like trying to compare it to MMA is ridiculous. Because, bro, how often do people win? Like, the figure four has been around for how long? Yeah, you know, thirty forever. years. You know, yeah. Flair never beats anybody with the figure four. You know, like Charlotte beats some people sometimes. But it's not like that. That's such a devastating move that I can't. I can't wait two more seconds. But she doesn't do the figure this. four, brother. She does the figure eight. Figure eight. You know, but like she was good guy. This way too. That was unbelievable. 